Welcome back. Let's continue. Wow, these graphics are awful. That is the one thing I can say about Resident Evil 4 that is awful. The graphics. By today's standards, they're awful. By the standards of 2005, whenever this game came out, they were fucking amazing. But no, they've aged quite a bit. I see that. I think an egg would fall down, but this is a game after all. I was about to say, I thought I hit the, sh <laughs> the fire button by accident. Okay, there's more shit up here. Ah, uh, fuck. Oh, a spider. I hate spiders. I got bit by a spider one time. That was not fun. I don't want to waste the bullets and shoot him. Whoa. We gotta watch those fucking string things. I'm not gonna waste a bullet on that door. Okay, see the save thing here? Don't save there because you're gonna save about five seconds later anyway, so. It's not worth it in the end. to meet Luis Sarah. Yes, his name is Sarah. He must have had a fun time at school. Then again, I have no room to talk because my last name is Funky. It's not actually Funky. I mean, it's weird. I'm not going to say it here, but it's a uh, tongue twister. Trapped in the wardrobe and they can't get out of Narnia. Okay. <laughs> ah, a little rough, don't you think? Like them? No. You? <clears throat> okay. I have only one very important question. Do you got a smoke? Got gum. Perfect. The big cheese. What? That was definitely genius, Leon. Yeah, go and kick a guy when you have a perfectly loaded shotgun jammed up your ass somewhere, and you can just shoot him with it. Sure, that terrible logic sometimes, but this game is fucking fantastic. Let's continue. Get ready for cutscene mania! Oh shit. Okay, here we go. Always keep your hands on the controller. You'll live longer. Feeble humans, let us give you our power. Resist this intoxicating power. <clears throat> hey, hey, wake up. Yay, uh, yay. Crawl out of one hole and into another. You want to tell me what's going on here? Americano, see? Now what brings a bloke like you to this part of the world? Oh, hey, easy, whoever you are. <sighs> Name's Leon. 
Came here looking for this girl. Seen her? What, are you supposed to be a cop or something? Nah, you don't look the type. Maybe. Okay, let me guess. She's the president's daughter? <laughs> That's too good for a guess. Wanna start explaining? Psychic powers. Nah, I'm just kidding with you, amigo. I overheard one of the villagers talking something about the president's daughter in the church. And who might you be? Me llamo Luis Serra. I used to be a cop in Madrid. But now I'm just a good-for-nothing guy who happens to be quite the ladies' man. Why'd you quit? Phew, <laughs> policia. You put your life on the line. Nobody really appreciates you enough for it. Being a hero isn't what it's cracked up to be anymore. I used to be a cop myself. Only for a day, though. I thought I was bad. Somehow I managed to get myself involved with the incident in Raccoon City on my first day in the force. That is the incident with the viral outbreak, right? I think I might have seen a sample of the virus in a lab at the department. Hey boy, I'm not done. Do something, cop! After you! Leon. Sorry I couldn't get in touch sooner, but I was uh, a bit tied up. You're okay, right? I'm fine. There was a male civilian held captive. According to him, Ashley's in a church somewhere. What happened to him? He managed to escape. Do you have a fix on the location of that church? No, but apparently there's a secret passage in the village that leads there. I'm heading back to the village. Okie dokie. Artichoke. Where'd the body go? Where did the body go? Okay, who cares? Okay, I still have my gun for some reason. Over here, stranger. My mommy told me not to talk to strangers. Rifle ammo, cool. Too bad I don't have a fucking rifle. Uh, okay, I'll end the part here. After I save. Okay. Go to the next video, and, uh, please... Comment and rate the video, please. I'd appreciate it. And subscribe. That, that would be much appreciated, too. Okay, thank you.